Hey guys, I'm back again. And I wanted to show you um, how I made the picture canvases on my wall here of my family. Get the picture. You got them? I wanted to show you guys how I made them um, from canvases and then I used pictures that I purchased from Walgreens. And I'm just gonna give you a step-by-step -step process of how to easily make them. Um, and I'll start that now. Okay, so first off, you find any picture you like. I think uh, black and white is the best to use with this project, just because I think it makes it look more realistic. So you find a picture you like, you buy the canvas size that you want. It can be any size. I had different sizes. Um, I also purchased this paint from uh, Hobby Lobby, a sponge brush, and Mod Podge. It's, it's, it's like a glue. And they have different kinds. You have the gloss, matte, whatever finish you want. That's the uh, type of uh, Mod Podge you purchase. Um, so first off, I painted the canvas black. The whole canvas. This is one that Charlie messed up, my daughter. So I painted the whole canvas black. You don't have to paint the inside. If you notice, the inside is not painted. Just make sure you get all the sides, the corners, um, and the top part here. Then once you do that, um, you let it dry, of course. You, you take the Mod Podge. You you glue the Mod Podge. I mean, you put the Mod Podge on the back, on the top of the canvas, like that. And then you place your picture on top. So you can use the Mod Podge to put your picture on, and also to add a uh, to add a certain look on top of it. So this is a finished project um, with a picture on it. It's Mod Podge. You can also see the brush streaks in it, and I really like that. You can really make it define um, by putting uh, brush streaks in it, make it look more realistic. And some people, and I thought about doing this, but I was like, nah. You could use the black paint and go around and just blot it and give it that, like a vintage feel. And you can put some black paint all the way around here and then rub it off with a rag and it'll have like a vintage look all the way around the, um, the canvas. So that's it, thank you guys.